All righty, greetings. Today we are playing Dragon Eclipse. This is a digital version of a game with miniatures and whatnot coming from Awakened Realms. Later this year, I believe, we have back the physical game. This does not play exactly like the board game. This is kind of like a reimagining in essence. And you'll see this is kind of like a roguelite, roguelite deck builder type of game that has some similarities to a certain monster catching game. So I kind of have already started a campaign to kind of get the logistics of how stuff plays. So we are just going to continue that. And based on how well this goes out and around and received and whatnot, I may do even more of these. All right, so you can move with the W, A, S, E, D. You interact with a Q or an E or, or the E or by pressing on there. So Missling's Quarters. So if we look here, you can see the ones that I currently have. I have Pine Queek, Activation, Talent. All this will make sense when I show you how we do combat. And then we have Iceling, Golomo, and Fail. All right, so now we come over here. And the Village Chef. Check our daily special, so you usually can get a random item from them. Every now and then, the Iceling wants to play, but not right now. Sometimes your fail does. They'll have exclamation points above them. Here's the cards compendium. So here's all the cards that are currently would be available. And come around here and down. Up oh, there we go, down. And the blessed tree. These are different blessings you can get, which kind of power up your mistlings, as they're called in this one. Over here, we have the mistling hatchery. So I don't have any eggs currently hatching. There's my Pine Queek, Matt as ever, the trainer, and there we go. So now we will go out through our adventuring and see if I can actually win this time. So basically you have a certain amount of days, so yeah, we're just going to go there, difficulty one. Go forth, and we can choose which mislings we grab. So let's go ahead and grab Pine Queek. Um, let's see. Iceling. We're actually going to move Pine Queek up there. And then fail. All right. So now you're on this little map. So you'll see up here we have 12 days to eclipse. That basically means we can do 12 battles. Right now, I have this fruit cell, which permanently increases the selected mislings max health by 10. So I don't quite know how to do that yet. I wonder if that's something that we do in battle. So unfortunately, I have to do an easy battle. So let's just fight it. So you'll see they have the their health down here. You have what their plan of attack is to do here, the only two damage each of those. This one's going to rest. And then down here, it's got a special ability of permanent lifesteal. So when you activate, there's an activate mislings card, or at the end, you're going to activate all the mislings, and your front mislings going to attack. So right now, my attack here is two, his attack is five, and his is zero. When I activate him, then I'm going to attack a random enemy with 50% power. And the talent is when hurt, I'm going to add one of those blind anger cards to your hand. The Iceling's talent is he gains additional power equal to the number of cards in your hand. So right now it's five. As I play cards, it's going to go down. And then the activation is I apply one string to the front missing. Might be self, so I'll make his power greater. And then the fail is you revive the first fainted missling with one health, and then... If he's activated, he activates all the others, so kind of a chaining type of thing. So I think we are going to start by applying the shield. So you basically grab a card and then point where you want it to go. So we're going to go there. 
And then I can have a specific person attack. So if he attacks, he attacks for four. Um, I think we'll do that. We'll wham, bam. And then I am out of energy. As you see, I only have en four energy. So once you're done, you're going to press this. Is this what I can do? Oh, I can. So I'm going to permanently increase the ice lanes by 10. There we go. All right. So hit. Though it stopped. We do a bunch of attacking. We've killed him. So now blind anger, exhaust, remove from the deck until the end of battle after playing. So this is attack a random enemy and it costs zero to do. So I think we will do that. We just pulled up and he randomly attacked for zero. So that was not helpful. Um, so I can apply the shield. He's only going to take two or I can attack for four. I really should start doing the attack the first card, but I still have one more. Oh, that's right. Cause the blind fury was zero. So we are going to be able to put a shield on him. Done. Ooh, my fails down. My fail doesn't have much energy. Doop, doop, doop. So we are going to, let's activate the missling. And he's going to be attacking by five. So let's put a shield on him. And let's put a shield on him in case he goes after him again. And attack. So that was vulnerable that they put on. All right, so I got mist berries. I got gold. So you use mist berries to get these power-up bonuses. So if this one is every fifth time hurt, you gain one energy next round. This cost me four. If I just go through, I get an extra mist berry for every five I have. In addition to that, I get to choose a card up here to add to my deck. So let's go with Fury. We'll add that card. And then if I want to take another one, it costs me mist berries. I'm not a big fan of the glowing box, so we will just go forth and get me another mist berry. And then uh, as you add power-ups to specific people or to the same mist lane, it does start costing more. But once you add three is how you level them up. So let's come over here to this treasure. Click, click, clickety-clack. So now I get a card, discard three to do an attack. Running wheel, wither one, wither is every time this card is played, decrease its value by wither count until the end of battle. Activate, trigger a misling, ooh, that's actually kind of nice. Every time this card is played, decrease its value by wither count. So I think we are going to take running wheel. Yeah, we're going to take that. So now, so these are easy battles. These are regular battles. And then these are hard battles. So in addition to that, as you come up here, you'll kind of see you got a merchant who you can buy cards from or food. I don't have enough money for any of that. Then up here is the care center where you can heal or enhance. It costs $100 to enhance. And so I need to get money for that. So I say let's come down here. So this this regular battle will get me another treasure chest. So let's fight that. Alrighty, so I can't so one. Because I could double his strength and then attack, and that's gonna do a pretty big attack, but then I won't be able to do a shield, but I don't have a shield. So let's Double his strength. Why didn't it? Maybe because he didn't have strength. Maybe I messed up taking that card. All right. Let's do this one. And he'll attack. And then I'm out. So, ouchie, ouchie, ouchie. So I have shield. So we are going to activate him three times because that allows me to add a bunch of strength and do all that attacking right there attack attack so he's going to be adding vulnerable to all misslings let's activate again and 
Sure, shield. And attack. And there we go. Bam, bam, bam. Do, do, do. Oh, that's what it is. It increases that by one. I thought it was the value. Um, We are going to do that. And then... Huh. Let's... No, I need the shields. And back there. Oh, wait, no, because he's going to be doing more than six. It's going to be at, like, four and four. He's going to be doing damage. I... Ow. Why are you attacking him? I thought they attacked the front one. Guess not. And that's the other thing you'll notice. They don't heal up between battles, and there's... Some of the food helps heal, but that's about it. Um... Activate twice an attack. Activate a missing five times. That one's pretty good, but it's the three. You know what? We're going to still take that. So now if we look over here, so ointment bottle. Reviving this missling after battle causes zero mist berries. When an incoming attack is fully blocked, draw one. Still don't like any of those. So let's just keep going. And doop 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 doop. Because there's no way to heal them that I have found. So let's go down here, grab the treasure chest, click, 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 click. Yay. All right, so I am going to, instead now, I'm going to take my gold, and I'm going to go up, and I'm going to heal my Iceling, because he's pretty low. So we'll go to the care center, heal, heal him. He gets all the way filled. There we go. And now where else should we go? Let's work our way. Because that's going to be a hard battle to get to that treasure chest. Let's work our way up this way. See if we can get through these regular battles. So this doesn't seem too bad. Ooh, do I do the wither and do it three times? And then I can do more. You know, yeah. Attack, 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 attack. And do I, let's activate it one more time. Do I have shields? I don't. So we are just going to do an attack like so. And then go. And bam. So I have a couple of those. Increases power until. See, I thought that that's what the power is there, but. Um, blind anger. Blind anger. Apply six shields. Attack. Dead. He's dead. He's dead. And, oh, he knocked out my fail. That's not good. Um... Attack, 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 attack. So he's resting. And do I have an attack? I do. And smack him. Victory! Mist berries, gold. Alrighty, so activate all mistlings. I like that one. We're going to take that. End of battle, gain two mist berries. Every third knockout, permanently increase power by one. So let's buy that. Let's revive him. And then, so you'll see I already gave him one. So if I go to him, it's nine because it's the seven plus the two. So that'd be nine to put another thing on him. So we're not going to do that. Let's just continue on. Moving on out, moving on out. So nine days to eclipse. Let's go and do this regular battle. Oh, I hate that big guy right there. Um, I really should put the shield on him because he's getting low. So I can't do the five-time one. But we can activate him. Apply the shields and apply the shield of the fail. So there we go. Rest. Boop -de doop -de doo. Go all big up. There we go. Let's activate all mistlings. 
do all that madness. And then apply the shield. I really do wish these games would give you more energy like this, Slay the Spire. I like having more energy so you can play the cards, especially when they attack cards too. I mean, that's just crazy. Um, so at activate him twice. And then we are going to activate him again. We can use our blind anger. And I'm about to take a lot of damage and I can't do anything about it. I should have stunned him. Yeah, that hurt. And we'll just have him attack him. So I won. But my front guy's a little down, so we'll have to see about that. I don't have the 75 to heal him. Discard four, draw four. Overload is play this card as many times as the number of cards played this round. Grow. Every time this card is played, increase its value by grow count until the end of the battle. Gain energy. I don't like any of those. After attack, apply to vulnerable. Gain one multi-strike. Increase the amount of attacks for each multi-strike counter for one turn. Uh, nope, don't like any of them. See, like, right here, I wish we could use our Miss Berries just to heal them up. But, alas, you can't. Alright, so that was that one. I've never actually been over in this area before. So that looks pretty insane over there to get to that house. So let's come up this way. And see what comes in up here. So we got one guy with a big, so we definitely want the shields. We'll definitely activate him. And let's double that strength. So yeah, apparently it's just the strength that gets doubled. And unfortunately strength goes away. All right, so we can activate all mistlings. Activate that mistling. Do the blind anger. And sure, just to use it, let's use a shield. Should probably put him up though so he can do the knockouts, huh? My only problem is is that his oh I should have put it on Pine Creek. I wasn't thinking, I was thinking all the knockouts for everyone. Well we can switch them. <coughs> Scoozies. Have him activate, have him activate, and then have him attack, which gives him that knockout. There we go. What's insulate? Reduce next incoming damage to one. Every fifth activation, reduce energy costs of a random card in your hand by one until end of round. I like those. So let's give him the floating stone. And... I keep activating him, so let's give him the all-seeing eye. How about these cards over here? No, <coughs> don't like any of those. Ooh, I have the 103 gold. I've never enhanced. Let me maybe enhance. See what, what that does. Maybe it'll heal them as well. So let's enhance my Pine Queen. Oh, so it just increased their attack, it looks like. Oh, well. Well, now I know. And knowing is half the battle. So I have seven more battles I can do. So let's go see what I unlocked up here. Ooh, that looks fancy. I have a treasure chest here. Give me a bunch of gold. 22. And a salad, apply two dodge, dodge, prevents creature from being damaged, status counter decreases by one after each attack. All right. Can't really get there. Let me try and see if I can do, I've never actually accomplished one of these hard battles before. So let's see what happens. Um, we're going to have him have the salad. So let's start a battle. He has three. Um, let's see. I don't have the shield, so we are going to do this. 
and do all that craziness. Ooh, I already killed one person. I'm already doing better. And because of that cool thing, activate all mislings is zero. And that is it. See, I wish I had more energy. This would be really cool. That's all right. Got to really hope I can take him out. Um, so I have the shields. I know for sure I need to do the shield. Let's do the blind anger. And then attack. All right. Come on, Pine Creek. Come on, Pine Creek. So I have vulnerable. That's never a good thing. Um, see, every, like that's three. That's just, oh, it's so annoying. Let's add the shields. Let's add the shields. Let's activate the missling. Let's do a blind anger, anger attack. See, why is, mm, so much annoyance in this game at times already. Wait, wait, I might be able to do it. Do I, uh, let's activate him. Yes, I did it. I finally beat up hard battle. That's my first time, folks. All righty. Keep half strength at the start of your round. Well, that's kind of nice. And seeing as I have quite a few, you know what we are? We're going to add that to him. Boop. Discard three to attack. Discard entire hand. Apply one vulnerable. Uh, you know what? Sure, let's take that one. And there we go. Cool, let's go see what this big, cool green thing is. A healing totem. Oh, you can only heal one? That's not a very good totem. Oh, well. Well, my Pine Creek was getting pretty low. And this will, come on, give me gold and then I can go heal my other guy. There we go. Now we'll go heal my Iceling, and I'll be in pretty good shape to see where I want to go next. I bet you that other one there is an enhanced totem or something. Heal you. There we go. Go back. Go back. And where am I going to go now? So six days to Eclipse. Ari went there. I can get around there. So I just did a hard. So I can probably do a hard again, you'd think, right? So are you like elite? Yeah, I'm not elite. So I think we're going to try and go through this one to maybe get to that healing totem up there. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Um, we can do an attack. Sure. Do the attack. And a random attack. Put shields on you. Put... Oh, not enough energy. That's fine. Dink, 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 dink. Dink, dink. Um, do the activation. Activate. And... Ooh, that came down to zero. Mmm, so many zeros. That was a bit overkill. Oh, oh, you jerk. That's fine. That is fine. Let's activate all mislings. Activate him. And done. So we got the mist berries, got the gold. We need to revive him. Every fifth activation, heal missling with lowest health for three. That would be pretty good to put on there. So let's give him that one. And gain two energy next round. Yep, we'll take that. There we go. All righty. So came out of that pretty decent except for fail. Let's go here. And go to the hard battle. So I'm assuming at some point I need to be able to beef my guys up in order to be able to sustain stuff. Let's 
ooh, that's a lot of attack coming, but that's fine. Do I do the activated missling three or five times? Yeah, let's. I really like being able to do that. And with him being able to maintain the strength, he can now, uh, we can out activate all misslings again. Do a blind anger for zero, of course, and go forward. All right, so not bad, not bad, not bad at all. She's going to heal the front enemy. That's not cool. I don't like that at all. So activate BAM. Blind anger, blind anger, blind anger, blind anger. He's not attacking, so let's activate again. And proceed. So as you can see, the game is kind of about getting the right cards. Like, I didn't get all these cool activating cards to do a bunch of stuff. So that's very helpful. Um, let's add shields there. Let's add shields there. And discard three to do the attack. Of course, you'd attack the one guy and put shields on you, jerk. It's a lot of mist berries. Oh, I could go heal him again. Energy materializer. Start a battle, gain an energy. Shields gain. Deal one damage. Defends health from incoming damage until the next round. You know what we are going to? Let's put. I haven't done three on one yet, so let's put the third one on him. I thought it's supposed to do like some cool thing. Maybe it was more than three. Um, attack with power equal to shields. Attack two times. Yeah, we'll just keep going. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I thought something cool was about to happen. Oh, wait, I can go up here for my healing totem. Heal right there. So, I, yeah, I could have sworn it was like the three of those, but... I guess not. Where do I want to go next? So that's an elite battle to get there. That's going to be hard to do. That's an elite battle up there. You know, I wonder if I have to go and enhance him now that he's got the three things. Let's try the enhancement. So we're, he's at 18 out of 20 and three. Oh, it's right there. The enhance the sword. So it just adds a power. Yeah, we're not doing that. Um, maybe I'll go do a hard battle again and get to that other treasure chest. Yeah, let's do a hard battle and get to that treasure chest. Now that I know I can do hard battles, this is pretty cool. Um, activate. Oh, I put it the wrong one. Oh, I rushed it. I rushed it and there's no undo button. No. Activate all mislings. So, probably should do the attack as opposed to the shield because he can do cool evasion stuff. There we go. All that fun attack attack. I really did mess up putting that one on. I probably, sh I really should have put it on him. Um, blind anger, blind anger. Let's gain two. Double his strength. And go forward. Yep, there goes fail again. That's fine. Attack. And attack. And done. Well, we gotta revive him. Start a battle, gain two shields for ever, every blessing after this one. Start a battle, draw three. Uh, grow one, attack one time. Activate a missling four times, faint this missling afterwards. Mm. Well, he keeps getting beat up anyways. Huh. Yep, we're actually going to grab that card. Oh, I forgot to take it, so I didn't actually get it. Ha ha. I'm a moron. And go to the treasure. Let's get that open. So I probably should go heal Iceling. So 
Now, Curiosity, what do you have? Apply two dodge. Gain two energy. Twelve shields. Jeez. A lot of shields. So, come in here. Heal. Yeah, we'll heal him. Go back. Enhance. Let's enhance him by one. That way he at least can do some damage. And just so we can see what this is, let's do the hard battle. Ooh, an 80. What do we got here? Let's do that. And do all that activation craziness. Double the strength. Do a blind attack. So I wasn't able to do that attack, but oh well. And attacking. There's all that. Um, do, 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 do. We're going to activate him. Activate all mistlings. Blind anger. Blind anger. And done. Wow, I flew through that one. This is the best I have done yet. So like I said, I, I don't remember how many you have to add. Let's add a fourth one to them. Let's buy that. There we go. Missling is evolving. So you got to add four of them to evolve them. So now he is... Attack a random enemy with a random missling. So no longer at the 50% power. You add two of them. So I, have to, I can choose a new talent. Increase max health by 20. Increase power by 4. Let's increase his max health by 20. There we go. And then that card gets added. Cool. So I have now upgraded my first missling. Now I'm seeing how this game goes. Now I got it. Let's get a maximum effort in honor of Deadpool coming out this week. Um, there we go. And proceed forward. Now I kind of want to try and go and do an elite battle. All right, what are you? A growth totem. Yep, so basically we can enhance someone. Let's enhance you again. Yeah, let's go try that elite battle. I'm raring to go now. So which house should I go to? Let's go this way. So that looks like a fun house. Let's try an elite battle. Worst case scenario, I die. At least I now have upgraded... Oh my goodness, look how huge he is. Against a 200, when attacked, gain one wrath, become exposed every fourth round, increase damage received by 100% for one turn. Ick. So we're going to do that. We're going to do that. And like I said, I don't think this actually happens. Oh no, it does. Cool. Apparently you just discard as much as you can or it counts itself. He's about to do 14. Yeah, I evaded. Yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm getting all excited now. Activate all mislings. Blind anger. He's coming with 17. Let's attack. Yeah. Yeah. And throw shields on fail. Oh jeez. He hit everyone. That is not cool. That is, that is a bad thing that just happened. Um, let's double his strength. Let's activate him. Blind anger. Blind anger. Give me two energy next round. I gotta do 76 before he just decimates me. Because I think a decimation is coming. Uh, so let's double your strength. Let's do an attack. Do a shield. Do a shield. I don't think I'm surviving 22 times 5. Nope. Alright, so an elite attack. Not good. 
But as you can see, I got a bunch of experience, which gives me a mislean egg. Looks like you unlocked a mislean egg. Be mindful, though, they are nothing like regular eggs. To hatch one, you need to complete a unique challenge. All right. Lorexis. Flurry of attacks. Wither one. Attack four times. Got more stuff, so apparently I'll be a new avatar next time. All right, so let's go see how I do this egg thing. Don't forget to check your newly obtained miscellaneous egg hatchery. You can find it in the eastern part of the village. You can't miss it. It has a huge balloon attached to it. So this is the hatchery. It's like so. Block 150 damage in total with shield. So once I do that, the egg will hatch. All right, so see, this is what it kind of means. Some of your little guys want to do stuff. The golemo. Hmm. To your bashment, you find a golemo hitting on you. A, hitting on a rock. Hmm, golemos are very social creatures. Maybe this one just feels lonely. That spark in golemo's eyes, you're certain. It's love. Ahem. May I speak with the lady for a second? You take the rock and add some little details to it. Now it looks like a proper golemo bride. I wish all the best to the young couple. So he gets all happy and excited. And then if you notice up here is after you do a run, you can then go to the brewing cauldron and get a random consumable, which is a raw steak. steak apply four strength to selected mistling. So there we go. So that is the first run through. Like I said, depending on how well you were this is received and if you want to let me know if you'd like to see me do more of these i have done the first run like i said that was much better than any of the ones i've done and now that i've leveled up my one and know you need to do four on one person i'll you know how to approach this better in fact i may maybe level some of them up before i even come back and that way i can show you something different as opposed to me just doing the same old same old all right well thank you for joining me on the beginning of this adventure I would assume I'm going to do at least one more to kind of get your guys accustomed to this. And this way we can kind of get prepped that when the game comes, maybe I can do playthroughs of the actual board game for you as well. So if you go ahead and hit like, subscribe, comment, share, and ring the bell for the channel, you will be alerted when that stuff does come out. And until next time, hatch those eggs.